Digital devices have many different features such as portability. Different devices will have different features. Let's take a look at some of them now. Portability. A portable device is easy to carry around. This feature is related to its size and weight. For some devices such as a smartphone, portability would be a high priority. But for a television, not so much. Performance. A high performing device would perform jobs and tasks quickly. The speed of a device is the speed at which instructions are carried out by the processor. So this would mean faster the processor, higher the performance. The instructions are loaded onto the producer for, from the RAM. So consequently, faster RAM would mean higher performance. Sometimes the space in the RAM is full. The storage is used as an overflow called virtual memory. So storage is used to store files and programs. By the storage, more files and programs can be stored. The storage speed, as I mentioned before, will also affect the performance of the device. Another feature of digital devices is the user interface. Now this is a huge topic, so we made a separate video on it. But the basic understanding would be, users command and instruct a device using the user interface. Another feature of digital devices is connectivity. Data can be shared between devices using wired or wireless connections. You can also use connectivity for software updates or backups. Wired connections are usually faster and more reliable, but many prefer wireless connectivity due to the portability it offers. Media data can be read or wrote on using digital devices. Most devices contain inbuilt media, but adapters can be provided to externally connect media too. Digital devices need electricity to function. Low energy consumption in mobile devices would be a longer battery life. Due to economic problems, a lot of pressure is on the manufacturers to become more eco-friendly and to create devices that need less energy. Most PCs allow installation of additional components. They may have an expansion slot or ports such as USB port. Another feature of digital devices is the digital security features. This is another huge topic so we will be discussing it in a separate video. Well that's all for today. If you preferred it instead of a back in the face with your textbook then like and consider subscribing.